It feels really good to get a tie. <laughs> it was so hectic. So I think one point kind of feels like three at this point. Um, we fought really hard, and I think you know, we were happy we could pull it out in the end and just get a point. Laura and Jess both had nothing but praise for you for your performance. Um, did it ever feel like it was going to be overwhelming uh, from your point of view, being that the Kansas City had a play advantage? And surely you, know, you can prepare for it mentally, but being a uh, rookie, but this is your first time seeing it as a professional. Yeah, no, I mean, I never expected that. Look up four minutes in and we're down a player especially losing Lou in the back. But I think we all settled in really well and we just defended our butts off. And I don't think it was overwhelming because I think all of us just were like, all right, guys, we got to pull together and just get a point and try and get, we almost had the win. So um, no, I think all my teammates just did amazing and we just defended. <laughs> just that she had never played central defense before and that she was turning to you for advice. What, what were you telling her? Yeah, it's usually just yelling at me. I think it's a little bit of the other way around. Um, yeah, she was like, I mean, she's used to being so aggressive in the midfield, so she was like, McNabb, like, just keep me in, keep, keep me honed in. Um, just not to step and be so aggressive, especially being a man down. Um, but, I mean, she did amazing. Anywhere they put Jess on the field, she's going to be fine. How much do you rely on um, Haley providing that sort of organization in the back to yeah, Haley is crucial. She's always, she's our eyes. She can see the whole field. So she's always constantly just giving us direction, telling us what's open, what she sees. And yeah, she's super important. Uh, with, with the circumstances of the game tonight changing so early in the match, was having just played them a week ago helpful? Like, I think so. You really, you were playing the third half. Of, yeah. Like, yeah, I mean, we definitely knew their tendencies. We knew what they were going to do. So I think. You know, if you're going to go down, at least it was a back-to-back -back game, so we knew what they were going to do. They didn't change much, even being up a player the whole game. So I think we kind of stuck to our game plan, but just had to shift it a little bit. Um, yeah. Do you feel any better on the left when they're right side? Just around? I mean, it's probably always going to be a little bit more comfortable for me, just because I'm a natural lefty. But I think I've slowly gotten a little bit more comfortable on the right. <laughs> <laughs> oh gosh. <laughs> yeah, no, I think the the left side's probably more comfortable, but I'll play either. I was like, you're just getting interrupted by your, your coach and just saying legend like that. <laughs> She's hilarious. <laughs> That's so funny. Uh, you recently got a chance to travel internationally with the Greece. Um, what was the takeaway from that? Yeah, it was awesome. It's always great to go on an international trip and just you know, get some minutes in. I played two games, and we played against some really good opponents. Um, yeah, it's always great to play with, you know, some of the top players, at least my age. Um, and it helps me, at least, coming back into the league um, just to keep my game up.